Hi, I'm Extension Entomologist Mike Merchant and we're checking into a hotel today and we're also going to try to take steps to avoid bringing bed bugs home. Okay, the first thing I do is I go to the front closet and get out the luggage rack. The luggage rack um, in most cases should be pretty clean. If you have any concern you can always take a look at it. Look at the straps. The only place that there would usually be a hiding place for bed bugs would be right down in this area. I've checked this out. This looks pretty clean. I have total confidence that this is a good safe place to put my luggage. Now the idea by putting your luggage on the luggage rack is that you don't have any connection to the bed. You're not close to the bed. You want to keep it as far away from the bed as possible. Uh, I keep it out from the wall a little while. Now some people that are very concerned about bed bugs or actually find bed bugs in the room and can't do anything about it, the next best thing you could do is put this in the bathroom. You could actually store this in the uh, bathtub if you, if you felt like you needed to. But the main thing is you, you need to create some distance between your luggage and the bed. Don't forget your personal items like purses and backpacks or suitcases. You don't want to leave them on the floor next to the bed. If there are bed bugs in your bedroom, they're going to likely they're going to be mostly on the bed frame and headboard of the bed. So, if there were bed bugs, their behavior is to hide someplace in a dark spot after feeding during the night before the lights come back on. So if you have a briefcase or luggage or anything on the bed or next to the bed, the chances of them getting into that luggage is much greater. So much better to take that, that suitcase, place it on the desk or on top of the luggage rack, again as far away from the bed as the room will allow. One of the places that's most likely to harbor bed bugs in a hotel room is the bed board behind the bed. Now the reason for that is normally bed bugs would be on mattresses and box springs but they get changed frequently in a hotel. So the bed board is a very stable site. It doesn't move a whole lot. So if I'm visiting a room and, and I'm inspecting the bed, this is the first place I want to look. So get out your flashlight and look around the edges and cracks. Look for any signs of, of live insects. Uh, this, this headboard has some cracks in it that I would check quickly. and um, and also, if you can lift up a headboard that's attached to the wall, that's probably the number one spot to find bed bugs in a hotel room. So this bedboard is, is dark, unfortunately, which makes it very difficult to see things. But, um, but I'm, I'm, as I'm looking, everything is pretty clean. I don't see anything unusual at all along the cracks and crevices. So we're going to call this bed bug free for now. Now, bed inspection is not always absolutely necessary, but it, it, can, it makes some people feel more comfortable if they've had a quick check through the bed. And uh, most of us have a flashlight on our, on our cell phone, and, and I would just get down and uh, take the covers off the bed. Now, a lot of times bed covers in hotels are changed daily. They should be. And uh, there aren't a whole lot of bed bugs likely to be on a mattress like this, but this is where you would look for bed bugs, is on the edges of the mattress and the box spring. Uh, pull up the, the box spring. This is not going to be moved nearly as often. And check around the edges of the box spring, all the way around the bed. Uh, what you're looking for are tiny reddish brown insects that would be clustered along a seam. You might also uh, be likely to see droppings just be any kind of unusual black specks, especially that follow a welting of the bedding. That's going to be a, a symptom of bed bugs in the room. If you find bed bugs in the room, what do you do? Well, I, what I would do is go down to the front desk and just ask, say that you're concerned about bed bugs in your room because of what you've seen, and ask if you can get a, another room. Uh, if that's not possible, then again, you just resort to uh, making sure that you don't bring bed bugs home in your in your luggage. And with that, uh, that's that's our quick five-minute guide to avoiding bed bugs in hotels.